Hey there guys, it's up on 4503, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. In the last part, we took down... We finally finished the lighthouse and got strength, but then I realized that we completely forgot about the most important HM of the game. Silly me. Actually, you can see that in the captions in, uh... The last video. But anyway, this is the dance studio in Ecruteak City. Now, um... I don't remember showing- I don't think I showed this to you guys. But, um, each one of these trainers has a different form of Eevee. Uh, Flareon, Jolteon, Umbreon, Espeon, Vaporeon. You have to face every one of them. And after you face every one of them, you go and talk to this... kind of pedophilic looking... dude over here. Not only are the Kamino girls great dancers, they're also skilled at Pokémon. I always challenge them, but I've never even left a scratch. The way you battled it was like watching a dance. It was a rare treat to see. <laughs> oh yeah, you... Uh... <laughs> I want you to have this, don't worry. Take it. Alright, I was thinking of something completely different, but okay, we got HMO3, which contains... Surf! Obviously. I've only been playing this game for about 15 years, maybe. Probably. I forget when this came out. This came out in 2000. So I was in fourth grade. Which means I was. I don't know. I was young. Chibi Zeppelin. Chibi Zeppelin, I meant to say. Alright, well, I'm gonna cut back to uh, Olivine. So I will see you guys in a minute. I'm going the wrong way. Okay, sorry guys. I just wanted to show you one thing that I found really, really funny when, uh, your person is riding the bike. Look at his head. <laughs> it looks like Night at the Roxbury. That, uh, that, uh, skit from Saturday Night Live with Will Ferrell, Jim Carrey, and, uh, Chris Kattan. Alright, that was a really random thing. I'm, I apologize. But look how funny he looks. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> I don't know, I just found that really funny. Okay, I'm gonna cut back to Olivine now. No more wasting time. See you in a minute. Okay, guys, we're back in Olivine, and I'm gonna teach Surf to one of my Pokemon now. There it is. Okay, Buddha Vision contains Surf. Teach Surf to one Pokemon? Yes, I will. As a matter of fact, you're going to teach it to, well... Oh, yeah, Slowpoke can use it. Um, who should I use it on? Um, we'll use it on Croconaw. Yeah. Well, Slowpoke can learn the other water ones. That's good to know. I forgot about him. Because, uh, Surf is actually a very strong, uh, water-type move, so we're gonna replace Water Gun with that. Wow, my voice is pretty raspy today. Ugh, I hope it's not allergies or a cold or something coming. I haven't been- I haven't been sick in, like, a year and a half, I think. I used to get sick, like, every month. Alright, so now that Croconaw learns Surf, we are finally going to make headway to our next gym, which is Cinnabar, and I gonna need to use a repel, because all we're going to see is Tentacool. Tentacool. Don't get it. It sucks. Tentacruel is pretty good. Tentacruel, with an R, is pretty good, I guess. It has a lot of defense, and it's a uh, poison water type, but other than, other than that, nah, I would, I would pass it up. Like we are right now. So yeah, it's about time that Slowpoke became a little bit more useful. Because he finally learned Confusion, which is going to come in real handy. Him and Pidgeotto are going to gonna be the main hitters for this next gym. Oh, I think I've got a... Oh yeah, I do have a Super Propel. Nice. Alright. But we won't, probably won't get to the gym until the next part. There it is, Tentacruel. Um, yeah, you might want to pick one of these up. I don't know. I I don't I don't like them at all, but you know if they're your thing. I think they got pretty good defense. Fight me. I need to do at least one one or two battles. All right, let's do this. Who's this? Swimmer George. Oh, he's got like six. They're all gonna be the same too. 
Damn it, why do I always choose these? The boring ones. Nightshade. Ha! Wouldn't that be a bitch if he poisoned him? Ugh. I would literally rage right out the door. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> I hate it when it does that. Um, let's send out... Slowpoke. He still needs more experience. Especially if he's gonna be one of our main people for this gym. Why do I call Pokemon people? I've always noticed that in the last couple parts. Oh, also in the last couple parts, I've noticed that I basically have a catchphrase. I say God damn it way too much. <laughs> I wanted as a joke to like make a little slideshow or something of me just saying "God damn it" over and over again, but it would take way too much time because that's how much I say it. It's just one of my favorite swears to say, I guess. Well, I don't really like swearing, but I just really like emphasizing "God damn it," you know. But I'll, I'll try to refrain from saying it too much because I really do. I've noticed that. Star you. Um. Let's send out... Actually, yeah, Eevee. It's our first time seeing a star you, I think. Rapid spin. Useless move. See, that was a critical hit. <sighs> yeah, so I was watching TV today, and I couldn't help but laugh. Oh, come on. Um... I was watching Chappelle's show, and um, you know how those commercials come on? Oh my god, can you miss it even more? Seriously. He's gonna kill me with rapid spin. Wow, I thought he was gonna miss again. Okay, well, as I was saying, um, I was watching Chappelle's show, and you know these commercials that come up for that, like, those, like, sex lines or anything? And the girls are all, like, emphasizing, like, oh, like, literally, I watched one today, it was like, the freaking whore was like, Oh, um, I used to go out and party every night, but now I just sit at home and talk on the phone with people. I'm just like, Wow, you're a fucking loser, if you actually do that. Like, seriously? <laughs> what kind of life are you living that you need to, like, talk on the phone to think you're, like, cool or something? It's like, yeah, I was gonna go hang out with my friends and everything, but I'd rather talk to some random stranger who's jerking off to me at the other end of the phone. Part of my language, I'm sorry. That was inappropriate. But I had to get my thoughts out on that. That was disgusting. Why, why did I talk about that? Well, it's not, real, not necessarily disgusting, but... That's basically, that's basically what they're implying with it. Seriously. Oh, what the hell am I doing? Not even paying attention. Oh well. I can probably still beat him. I don't even think they have no water gun, so I think I'm good. Yeah, Tentacle is, uh, water type, but I don't think it ever learns, like, any water moves. It might learn Hydro Pump, but that's, like, way down the line. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whatever. Whatever. I apologize for that out outburst earlier. <laughs> that that was kind of out of line, but you know it, it's true. You know. Ugh. This is the stuff I think about when when I'm home and bored and waiting for episodes to upload on YouTube and render. Oh my god, it took forever. I got home from work at like 8 o'clock and I just finished like finished like putting out the, the two episodes like an hour ago. I got home at 8. It's now... Now I'm recording this. It's 11.36. Yeah. <laughs> it took a long time. Alright, so let's continue on. How much time do I have left? Sorry for the mouse right there. Wow. 
I don't even think I'm gonna make it to Cinnabar. These random encounters don't keep... I thought I had a repel on. Oh, because it's tentacruel. Yeah, the repel won't really work. To... The repel only works for, like, certain weak Pokemon. It doesn't work for stronger Pokemon. For some reason. Right, we're gonna skip right over you, because I want to get the Cinnabar. I'm probably gonna face all these trainers off screen for the experience. Um, it's gotta be another tentacruel. Oh. What the hell? Did, did that re repel wear off? Eh, who knows. Alright, I'm just gonna cut this battle out. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, I'm back, so let's continue. Oh, a few of those close one. Right, just head over this way. Oh crap, this is gonna be hard. Uh, go! Damn it. Alright, I'll cut it out again. See them? Okay, I'm back again. And I think we are finally here. See in Wood City. Wait, did I say Cinnabar before? Yeah, I did say Cinnabar. My bad. I meant C and Wood. Yes, you may heal. Alright, how much time do I have left? I have... a couple minutes. I'm probably gonna cut it in a minute after we go up. Let's do a little bit of exploring. Shall we? Alright. First off, what we're going to do is we're going to go in here, talk to this guy. Pokemon here find us something wrong. This is the doctor where we need to get the uh, the secret potion for the Ampharos in the lighthouse. Haha. -ha. Okay, knock that off the list. Remember, this lady's here. We're going to be talking to her after the gym. Oh, the repel was on. Um, this dude will give you a shuckle, I think, but it's useless, so we're not even gonna bother. Uh, I don't care. How much time? Okay, we're good. I get really paranoid. <laughs> Photo Studio. That was, that was for back when the Game Boy Color had that, that camera thing. I forget what it was called, though. Oh, well. Let's go more more rocks for rock smash. I don't know what's in there. What's up here? <gasps> oh my god, what is that? Yo, Chris. Oh, he's going street thug on us now. Wasn't that Suicune just now? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand, and it races through towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. Alright, you're getting a little bit too obsessive here, kind of scaring me. I want to see Suicune up close, I've decided. I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come on, Chris, let's battle now. We're not going to battle right now, we're probably going to battle on Thursday. So, I'll see you guys later. Thank you very much for watching. Once again, I apologize for the outburst for that was really rude of me. But I really had to get my opinion out on that. And it's kind of true when you think about it. Okay, I will see you guys later. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.